All right, it's uh, Neil from the Canadian Comic Band, and we're gonna go through this week's new releases that we have available in the store. Um, you can attack these Tuesday, uh, 8 p.m. online, Eastern. Let's start off with some indie stuff. Um, Nacelleverse. We've got different products in here. Um, Biker Mice from Mars, Power Lords, uh, Sectors, a lot of 80s products that I grew up with. It's kind of cool that they're getting their own series. Um, so this is a one-shot um, showcasing all those different stuff those toy lines that are coming to uh, the comics. Um, the Aftermath of Spawn 350, we got 351, and there are three covers. The third cover, it's The Virgin by Booth and McFarlane, and we had heavier pre-orders on this one, but we still have them for the stand, so don't worry. Um, Scorched, two nice covers. Barons did the uh, B cover. G.I. Joe, still coming out. Uh, regularly and uh, strong seller Andy Cooper covers I'm not a big fan of the black and white I think I'd rather this be a sketch than the uh, black and white inks and if you're into the ratios there's a 1 in 10 available um, Cobra Commander very strong seller and it's an awesome series number three I do like the uh, B cover by Paul Azaketa as something like that uh, he did the outcast art with uh, Robert Kirkman um, there is a 1 in 10 and there's the one in 25, and there should be a one in 50. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, it's the untold destiny of the Foot Clan. Um, Shredder's daughter is vying to uh, take control of the foot, and we'll see what happens, but this is the big issue. Um, people love these covers. The, the first two that came out, they're like 20 or $30 each. They sold out. Um, we got plenty for the stand, so cover price, no problem there. There are 1 in 10 variants, and a nice 1 in 25 virgin. My Little Pony, a little one-shot called Hair. Uh, we always sell My Little Pony in the store. It's, uh, it's a solid seller, and they sell well at the conventions. Stranger Things, part four, the final part of this mini-series. Uh, Star Trek. We don't sell a lot of Star Trek in the store. We sell a lot of it at the conventions, but just not in the store. <laughs> but if you want to subscribe to Star Trek, we can, we can hook you up. Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees. Um, every issue we've been selling out on the first day, so uh, get be quick, get there. Um, I think we have five copies of the A cover um, left, so if you need it, and you need it, because it's a good story. Dawn Runner uh, by Ram V, it's the first issue, new series, give it a shot, because it's good to try new things. Django Fett from Star Wars has his own series coming out. Um, it's weird they did Django Fett before Boba Fett. And there's the photo variant. Another Star Wars Visions this is the volume two. Um, I think it has a first appearance of a Sith in here. Uh, the art's really awesome. Um, Thrawn Alliances. I don't know, people like the Thrawn. Uh, High Republic, this one's a, a thicker issue, a little more expensive than the other ones. Night Thrasher continues with issue number two. Covers are nice. Resurrection of Magneto. I think that's a five issue series. Fantastic Four, Ryan North. Um, solid uh, solid read on those Fantastic Fours. Captain Marvel continues on. Spider-Woman. She's got uh, Spider-Boy jumping in there. So if you're a fan of Spider-Boy, you might want to check this out as he teams up with Jessica Drew. And then Spider-Boy number five. Yeah, number five. Getting crushed by an elephant. <laughs> Scarlet Witch, Quicksilver, number two. Uh, number one was a pretty good seller. Uh, Wolverine, Madripoor Knights. Um, this is connected to that, uh, that Jim Lee issue, uh, where Captain America, I don't know, I don't know what I'm saying. Captain America something. Uh, X-Men Forever, number one, a really nice Mark Brooks cover, and there's also the B cover by, uh, Lyrics. Lyrics started out doing Dynamite covers, I believe. Uh, Ultimate X-Men 1, already in the second print. We still have some uh, first prints of the Mark Brooks and in Lee. Uh, Invincible Iron Man always has great covers. I love these. Um, I feel like I should read it, but I don't. Ultimate Spider-Man number two, second print design. We actually got all our copies, so they're on the stands. And we do have the 1 in 25, and it is going for high dollars on eBay. <laughs> If you don't want to pay $80 for the first print in high grade, you can get a facsimile. Throw that in your collection as a placeholder, and there's also the foil cover. 
Web of Spider-Man, number one. Awesome Greg Capullo cover, and Greg Capullo is going to be at Niagara this uh, this June. We're going to be there too. Um, get some stuff signed. But this issue sets up a lot of Spider-Man stuff for the next couple of years. I believe it was a couple of years, not just one year, a couple of years. And there's a nice uh, Romita variant. It's got uh, Ben Riley, Scarlet Spider on there. And it is an expensive issue, and so we do have the one in 25. Goes for a little bit more than you expect as well. Uh, also, facsimiles. Here's a big one. Treasury size. I think this is the first treasury size facsimile that uh, they've done. Neil Adams art, cover, wraparound. Awesome. But of course, there is the foil. Foil cover if you want that shiny bling. More money, but uh, I think it's worth it. Superman has been a strong seller. Um, we keep selling out of the back issues, some, and a lot of them are sold out at the distributor. Um, Give this one a shot. We still have like the first few, uh, one, two, three, four. Um, I recommend it. Lee Bermeo does a nice uh, 80s Luther um, cover. This one has been delayed for months. It's finally in. Number nine, Jeff Johns uh, and Mikhail Janin. Janin. Titans. Uh, we got, I can't remember her name. Somebody else knows it. Um, we got a nice Sway variant. Red Hood, The Hill, second print. Uh, first one is sold out. Um, Red Hood is a fan favorite, and his series usually does really well in the back issue bins. Uh, World's Finest, we got our um, origin of the first team-up of Joker and Lex Luthor, and a little lead-in to the big uh, um, storyline coming out with uh, Mark Wade. So uh, check that one out. And it also has William Shatner variant. So they've done well with the Paul McCartney, the Jack White, Nicolas Cage, and now it's it's the Shat's turn. There is a nice Christian Ward, one in twenty-five. Catwoman, uh, Nakayama covers. Uh, all these covers are actually really, really good, and we got them all in stock. Sozo Micah doing all the uh, Women's History Month, and there's the one in twenty-five by uh, is that lyrics? Yeah, lyrics. My boy, John Constantine, number three. And I love the Sandman, not Sandman, Swamp Thing uh, variant cover. Another delayed book, Batman 89 Echoes, uh, features Harley Quinn. This thing has been delayed by what, four months? Justice League, Godzilla, Kong, number six. Uh, they are doing final printings on the first four issues. Uh, we will have those coming in for, because people keep picking this book up. Um, so, but they're do, they're cutting it off. They're not reprinting it anymore. So the next batch of reprints will be the final ones. And how can you not love Bruno Redondo covers on Nightwing? I wish he went back to the interior art though. Tom King's Wonder Woman featuring Superman. We got a few covers here. Uh, yeah, March. Love the Sozo Micah. And we've got the one in 25. Also, something new, we have a local artist who dropped off some books, and we're going to be selling them on the stand, and they're called Martyrs of Revelation. They're, it's a four-part series. Uh, it's more prestige, trade pa paperback-ish. Um, the first three are 16, and, or sorry, the first two are 16, and the third one is a bit bigger, and that one's 20. Um, we will be selling these in the store. Uh, Mark Loader is the writer, and every issue has a different artist. Um, so if you want to support local talent, um, please do so over here with the Martyrs of Re Revelation 1 through 3. And that is the new books for this week, Tuesday at 8 p.m. on the CanadianComicBin.com. You can scoop all of these, and um, there are people that attack it right away, so you, you do have to be quick on some of those, especially the ratios. All right.